Happy Halloween! At least if my schedule is correct, this video drops off on Halloween. And so, there's a little bit of a trick-or-treat to this one. If you're not aware of this, um, Google had announced uh, earlier this year that they are abandoning, abandoning, yeah, yeah, giving up um, Google Cloud Print. Now, what's that mean to you? Well, most of you, it's going to impact one way or the other when they kill it off January 1st, 2021. So normally what you could do is you can go into your Gmail or you go into your Google Drive and you click the print button, the printer control pops up and you send it to your printer and everything is honky dory. Uh, let me show you an example of this. So from Google Chrome, I'm gonna go over to the IRS website. And we're gonna open up the form 1040 because it is in PDF. And there's the PDF form. And if I click on the printer option, it brings up the printer. Um, so, you know, I can send it directly to the printer there. And the same is true with a different browser using the same thing. There it is, I can send it to the printer, it pops up. Now, uh, with the cloud printer going away, um, what would happen is, is you would sync your printer to your Google Chrome, which would then sync it to your accounts, and it didn't matter which browser you were using, you could print. With that going away, it, it's going to change some things. And so let me give you an example because I had to um, help a client today because apparently Google is starting to kill it off. So we've seen this work. But in your email, this is the same form. Um, if I click it here, it pops up. If I go to print, it doesn't bring up the printer controls per se. Um, and I think some people might be used to using Control-P at this point to print and so on and so forth. Yeah, um, just to be aware of, like I said, Google Cloud Print is is killing it off. So um, in this particular case, I still have the option to print because it will allow me to do it, but it will eventually go away. And what you will have to do then is download it, save it, and then you can open it in whatever PDF viewer you have. In this particular case, I'm using Firefox, or uh, not Firefox, but the other program there. But normally I have Foxit uh, installed. And so Foxit or Adobe Reader or whatever program you're using uh, would open it up and you can print it from there. Uh, open with, yes, I do have Foxit. Um, I recommend Foxit over Adobe, but that's just a matter of personal preference. So yeah, and then from here you can print it. So just to be aware um, that this is coming down the pipeline in about three months, um, and you're not going to have a, a, a choice in the matter. Um, Google is killing off the cloud print, um, and like I said, I've seen uh, with a client today, I had to do a remote in to look that they are starting to kill it off. So just be aware of that, you know, that it's going to happen and then you'll have to learn how to do alternate printing. If you need assistance when that happens, and I'm sure come January 1st, uh, well, it would be January 2nd, come January 1st, 2nd, the first week, I'm gonna get tons of phone calls on why is my printer not working with my um, browser, yeah. Um, so there's the number. Give me a call. I'll come fix it or I could remote in and try to show you how to do it. But yeah, pretty much that's what's going to happen. Google is killing off that process. Um, they claim that they're going to leave the process available for a little while longer on uh, Google Suites, which is the business side. If you're paying for the service for Google, they, they claim that it's not going to go away from them for a while. So if you have a business account with Google, which is called Google Suites. Um, it's not supposed to go away. However, the one I just did a remote with today does have the business uh, service and Google Cloud Printer stopped working. It's not, not there. So I had to show them how to print a PDF using Foxit and then from Foxit, then you could print it. So just be aware of that little trick or treat thing that's coming around. It, it's gonna mess up a lot of people, a lot of business clients use uh, Google Suites. Um, for a lot of things and so 
If it impacts you, give me a call um, and I, we will show you how to, like I said, with this little video, it shows you how to get around it too. But yeah, it, it, that's what's going to happen and there's not a whole lot we can do about it. So anyways, if you found the video useful, like, share and subscribe. And yes, I know I've mentioned this before, as I found out, if you don't have a Google account, you can't subscribe. Um, but that's okay. Um, there's a video on here on how to create a shortcut desktop so you can click every day. Videos drop at seven in the morning. So uh, you can leave a comment uh, or get a hold of us through Facebook. There's our phone number. There's our address. If you need us, give us a call. Talk to you later. Hey!